Welcome back, viewers. This is Sweet Battle Scars again. And I am back in Master Hunter 4 in the online mode. And I've got a group of hunters here, and we're gonna go after the blue Rathalos, Azuri Rathalos. And um, it's uh, I, I'm still making my way through some of the later online quests, of course, in high rank, in the high rank section. And I think I've got a few monsters still before I can finally call this a day and move on to Monster Hunter 3 Ultimate again. But for now, I'm gonna keep enjoying uh, the online servers on in Monster Hunter 4. And now, don't get me wrong, I'm gonna keep playing this game. I'm, I love this game. I'm gonna keep playing uh, mostly online. But uh, like I said, I'm gonna be focusing on making videos of Monster Hunter 3 Ultimate very soon. So, thought I'd show you Azuri Rathalos today in Monster Hunter 4. And this guy appears in this map. Just like uh, Rathalos does. Forget what this is called, I think the High Peaks or something. And I've got my uh, Zaboa Zagiru hammer upgraded pretty much all the way, I believe. I think I've finally upgraded this hammer all the way, so it should work fine against uh, this guy. Since his weakness to ice might come in handy here. But uh, I've got a group of three other hunters. So I think we're gonna be great. And I find it that it's really not difficult to find people to play with in the, the Japanese servers. And I think that is just because there are just like 10 times more people playing uh, Monster Hunter in Japan that, than there are here in the US. I mean, you know, that figure is way off. It's just a... Uh, it's sufficient to say that there's a lot more people playing Monster Hunter in Japan than in the US. So, of course, it's a lot easier to find servers with uh, hunters ready to hunt. And uh, I, I play during different times of the day, sometimes uh, midday, sometimes in the afternoon, and weekdays and weekends. And I always find a group of hunters willing to play. I'm not complaining about the uh, Monster Hunter 3 Ultimate servers in North America or anything like that. But sometimes it takes a little more time to find people. That's been my experience. Maybe you've had a different experience. Oh, I don't know, but uh, that's that's been me. But it's still great. I found lots of really great people in the three ultimate servers. Oh, I just got blasted. Didn't think I was gonna. But anyway, it's it's always really awesome to have a a good community of uh, friends and hunters to play with. Whoa, that was a good one. This guy got me in mid-air. <laughs> I'll give him that. That was awesome. Ah, oh, Hit by my own hunter. Still wearing my uh, Joe armor. I love this armor. I love Devil Joe and it's in his gear. So this armor uh, has pretty good defense. I've actually upgraded it a bit. Quite a bit with armor spheres. And so it's got more defense than the original when you first get it. And uh, this guy's putting up a fight. Wow, he's gotten me twice with his fireball. And uh, he's just going away. He's moving a lot. I'm trying to get a KO. I'm trying to see if I can get a few hits on his head. See if I can get a KO. Let's uh, go after. All right, he's down. Ah, oh, stupid tail. No, oh, he's down. Don't mind if I just get in here with my handy hammer. There it goes. This is what I wanted. Perfect. I love using the hammer against these uh, wyverns, Rathalos Rathian. It always uh, seems to work great. I like it. 
And I'm still also upgrading other weapons that I'm going to be using in future videos. Fighting against uh, some of the other monsters that are coming up in the high rank. And I gotta say, I'm really liking the way that uh, I'm taking... Or the direction that I'm taking these weapons in. Especially the Insect Staff. Uh, there is a lot of upgrading to do with the Insect Staff. So I've had uh, some fun with that. I've been translating some of the things to try and understand what exactly it is that I'm doing. And it's worked fine. I am upgrading... I'm currently upgrading two... Darn. Two uh, insect staffs. The uh, Kidding Staff and the uh, Goamagara Staff. So those are pretty good. And I've actually used the Kidding Staff... Uh, kidding Insect Staff before. I think you guys have seen that video. Oh, wow. I was being careless. So I really like those ins uh, insect staffs, and the insect staff itself is becoming one of my favorite weapons to use. Alright, we're breaking everything. Break his face. Oh, okay, he's gonna be limping. Yep, he's limping. Um, is it a good idea to maybe... Oh, tail! Nice, don't mind if I just carve it. I don't think he's gonna come at me, and... I think it might be a good idea to capture. Uh, I guess those guys don't really want to capture. They're just going away at him. Okay, we're not capturing. Let's keep going. Let's break his face even more. And it's over. I guess uh, his face was uh, as broke as can be. <laughs> All right. Ziri Rathalos. Great monster to fight. I'm working on this armor. Even though I don't think I'm really gonna be using it, I wanna get the Silver Rathalos armor in Monster Hunter 4. It's, I think, one of the best armors in this game. Of course, that'll change once we get 3 Ultimate and we get to go into G rank. That'll be exciting. Wonder. I hope they introduce a new monster or a couple of new monsters for G rank. Maybe a few other subspecies, I'm sure they will. So that's something to look forward to. Gonna be doing some mining too. There is a, a kind of ore that I still can't find. I go everywhere, I go into Volcano, I go here. Low rank, high rank, and I, I just can't find it. I don't know, I don't know where I'm gonna find that thing, but... Oh well, that's it for this video guys. Thank you so much for watching. Stay tuned for the next video, and I will see you guys next time.